Uh, so my name is Rafi Gidron. I'm a founder and uh, chairman of Israel Brain Technologies. And uh, we are uh, trying to accelerate uh, brain tech. And um, I'm sure uh, uh, we're going to hear a lot about uh, research in uh, brain. And uh, we are trying to support uh, acceleration of research. But we believe that in addition to the funding and the efforts that uh, needs to go into brain research, and uh, there, is, uh, there should be an effort to try to take the research results and uh, turn, the, turn it into solutions that uh, affect uh, people's life, and this is what uh, we are about. Um, so, uh, just to give you, to take a snapshot of uh, Israel uh, from a research, research perspective, uh, we are uh, uh, standing in a quite nice spot in terms of the uh, publication. Um, we are also part of uh, the Human uh, Brain Project, um, and uh, not bad for a country of uh, less than 10 million uh, people. Uh, also, uh, universities, all seven universities have uh, brain research uh, centers, and uh, so are the uh, hospitals with uh, quite advanced uh, neuro innovation and uh, departments. In terms of uh, companies, there are a uh, little less than uh, 100 companies, and uh, Israel Brain Technology Database has uh, 95 companies, I believe, today, and they are in uh, diagnostics, uh, pharma, and, uh, and rehabilitation, and medical devices. Uh, most of them are uh, relatively small and uh, young companies. Uh, some examples, uh, and in fact, this uh, ties into the discussion that I came in late, but I heard uh, DBS and uh, brain stimulation, so Insight Tech uh, that is trying to uh, affect uh, Parkinson essential tremor with uh, uh, focal uh, ultrasound. Uh, non-invasive focal intrasound, uh, companies like uh, Brainsway that uh, tries with the elect electromagnetic field to affect uh, various uh, diseases such as uh, depression, Elminda El that follows uh, brain activities and responds to drugs using EEG and some small pharma companies uh, like Exonovo. Um, so uh, I'm, I'm a serial entrepreneur, and uh, my, uh, my background uh, is uh, in electrical engineering, telecommunication, but uh, brain uh, is my passion. And uh, a few years ago, I decided to uh, put my time and energy into uh, trying to accelerate uh, brain uh, research and turn it into and turn those results into uh, into technologies and, and build an industry. Uh, so the slogan is uh, from startup nation to brain nation. Um, and uh, together with the President Perez, uh, we launched an initiative uh, called Israel Brain Technologies. And our mission is to accelerate and support uh, the full life cycle of brain technologies and innovation. Uh, together with the McKinsey and company, we build a, a plan, a program, a business plan, and uh, we're essentially focusing on being an evangelist, uh, convener, and catalyst. Uh, as an evangelist, we are trying to uh, advance the brain agenda across uh, all sectors in Israel. We built a database uh, with all the uh, companies and uh, researchers in the brain field. Uh, right now, it's uh, based, it's uh, only limited to Israeli companies and researchers, but we are in the process of expanding it to be um, a global database. So if you want to find uh, researchers in a certain uh, area, DBS, you can find those on our database. If you want to find a company that deals with uh, Parkinson disease, it's there. Um, we, uh, we have uh, a blog and, uh, um, and, and uh, reports, news reports. Uh, we are lobbying for go with government to uh, uh, add or to expand the support for uh, brain, uh, brain technology and research. And uh, we're promoting uh, invest investment and collaboration 
uh, both with government, sector, uh, private sector, and uh, academia. Um, as a convener, we're uh, bringing together all stakeholders, uh, be it uh, researchers, uh, uh, investors, inventors, uh, scientists, uh, and uh, uh, companies, uh, both uh, small and large. And uh, we are uh, uh, conducting a brain tech uh, conference. Uh, actually, the last one was uh, a few weeks ago uh, with two of the panelists uh, that uh, participated in, in, uh, in this conference. And what we're trying to do in this conference is mix uh, the different disciplines. So we have, uh, we're trying to bring young, uh, young entrepreneurs that would otherwise uh, be maybe doing uh, an app development, a uh, startup in the develop a certain app, uh, but then we're trying to sway them to, uh, uh, to put their energy into areas that uh, will touch on people's life. Uh, actually, one of the things that uh, was really exciting for me, this conference was uh, um, a young uh, guy, in his 20, he's 22 years old, uh, with a new company called uh, Mind, Mindlift uh, that is trying to uh, solve for ADHD with uh, a Muse uh, device, uh, reading EEG with uh, biofeedback. And he stood on stage, presented his company, and uh, told us that uh, he was uh, at the previous conference two years ago and got inspired and talked with people and started the company. So those are the kind of things that you know, we're trying to do, and, and we actually see results. Uh, we have now a community of over 2,000 uh, people. Um, and uh, in addition to the BrainTech conference, we have uh, about uh, monthly uh, meetings uh, on various uh, subjects uh, related to brain research and technology. As a catalyst, uh, we're trying to promote um, brain and overcome the value of that uh, that exists in taking research into, uh, into technologies. We have a $1 million uh, uh, dollar brain prize that uh, Professor Tono actually won in 2013. Um, and uh, we have innovation uh, workshops and uh, uh, two new two new uh, programs that we're starting that I'll describe in a second. These are some pictures from our BrainTech, uh, the last BrainTech conference. And as I said before, it mixes anything from art related to brain to heavy research to technology. So we're trying to kind of bring together the worlds uh, as it is an interdisciplinary field that requires people from different areas and different disciplines. Uh, those are some of the uh, issues that were discussed in uh, BrainTech 2015. Um, so where, where do we take it? What's the next uh, phase? Uh, again, in the spirit of taking and trying to accelerate research into uh, projects that are startups that will develop into uh, companies that will uh, solve for various diseases, uh, we're starting uh, two programs. The first one is uh, Brain Innovation. It's a launching pad uh, accelerator. It will be a four-month program where we're going to bring in researchers and young companies that are looking for support. They have an idea, but they don't know how to go about taking those ideas and turn them into uh, companies. Well, educate them through a series of lectures with uh, experts that uh, uh, have experience, entrepreneurs and subject experts in IP and others. It's going to be a four-month uh, uh, course with a uh, few meetings uh, a week, and uh, we're going to uh, broadcast it, so you guys are welcome uh, to join. It's going to be uh, online. The other uh, program is uh, BrainGels, and BrainGels is uh, a network of angel investors that are passionate about brain. So uh, in this program, what we're planning to do is uh, uh, 
recruit and screen uh, projects, startup projects in uh, Brain that are looking for funding and uh, select uh, those that uh, are, uh, would, would qualify, sorry, um, and uh, bring them to the group of angels for uh, uh, funding. So our hope is that uh, if today uh, we look at the, uh, the community, of, the Israeli community of brain that has uh, about 300 research laboratories, uh, less than 100 startups, and uh, um, to, to double this number and more in the next uh, few years with those programs. So, um, how can you get involved? Uh, you're welcome to submit for uh, the Brain Ovation and uh, get online and, and uh, take part of it. If uh, you are an investor who's interested in making investment seed and, round, and the early stage investment in, uh, in brain technologies and brain companies, you're welcome uh, to join, uh, talk to me, uh, or uh, get online and, and join our uh, groups. If you have a, a company that uh, is looking for funding, uh, please uh, communicate with us. Um, and uh, we are on... Uh, Facebook, Twitter, uh, etc. Thank you very much. Thank you, Rafi. Thank you.